朋友们，大家好，我是中国首次火星探测任务工程总司 Good Reset. In 1903, Tsiolkovsky put forward a rocket equation which make us out of the cradle of the Earth become a reality. It has been 120 years since this person published this formula, and more than 60 years since the first man-made Earth satellite was launched on October 4, 1957. 100 years is a lifetime for us as each individual, but compared with the 1.4.6 billion years of Earth's history, it's only a moment. Yet we human beings have not only stepped out of the Earth's cradle, but also have continued to write new heights into space. The successful launch of the world's first man-made Earth satellite in 1957 marks the beginning of the space age of mankind and set the first milestone for human space exploration. In the past 60 years, following the development law of from near orbit to farther orbit, from the unmanned mission first and then to the manned mission, mankind has achieved missions of manned flight around the Earth, unmanned lunar exploration, and manned landing on the Moon. Today, we have reached. O planets and the major types of small celestial bodies in the solar system. After nearly six decades of space exploration through close-range remote sensing of extraterrestrial objects, in situ detection, and laboratory analysis of real samples, mankind has been able to answer the fundamental questions like what it is, where does it come from, where it's going, and what does it have to do with us. And many important scientific discoveries have been made on the basic issues of the universe, enabling mankind to gain new knowledge and discoveries about the mysteries of the universe, broaden knowledge and enhancing capabilities, expanding the scope of human activities, and promoting the progress of human civilization. Space exploration is not just a scientific or technical activity; it is endowed with more connotations and missions, and has a wide range of Influence in such fields as science, technology, human resources, economy, and people's ideology and culture. It is also because of the wide range of influence of space exploration that mankind has made the return of samples from Mars or even a manned landing on Mars a future development goal. China's space activities have also followed the same development path. On April 24, 1970, the Dongfang Hongwan satellite was launched. On October 15, 2003, Yang Liwei orbited the Earth. On October 24, 2007, Chang'e 1 successfully launched. China has made remarkable achievements in space development. To go out of the Earth-Moon system and enter more distant deep space is the dream of several generations of Chinese space people and an inevitable choice for China's space development. China's first Mars exploration mission. After a decade of planning, demonstration, mission design, engineering development, and mission launch. Was successfully launched on July 23, 2020. After 202 days of Earth-Mars transfer and 93 days of Mars orbit, our rover Zhurong landed safely on May 2015, 2021, in the pre-selected landing zone in the a southern part of the Martian Utopia plain and set foot on Mars on May 22, 2021, achieving the goal of orbiting, landing, and roving in one mission successfully. Go beyond the Earth-Moon system. Why are we aiming at Mars? Why Mars has become the focus of deep space exploration today? As a close neighbor of the Earth, the farthest distance between Earth and Mars is 400 million kilometers. With our existing space technology, Mars can be reached in about seven months. Such a mission cycle is more appropriate. In addition, its natural environment is the most similar to Earth. So, whether it is robotic exploration or future human landing on Mars, it is easier to 
adapt to the Mars environment. Therefore, technical considerations such as accessibility and environmental adaptability are one of the factors. Another factor is from the perception of scientific research. Mars is considered an important research target for understanding the evolution of Earth and the planets in the solar system. The existence of water and life on Mars as well as the condition to support life has been the focus of human attention. There are many similarities between Mars and the Earth. Whether Mars is the future or the past of Earth is also an important question to be studied and answered by human beings. In addition, mankind are always dreaming of finding a new home outside the Earth, so the knowledge of gravity, magnetic field, atmosphere, and the material composition of Mars has become the most basic knowledge for mankind to understand Mars. China's first Mars exploration mission focuses on these scientific issues, with seven scientific payloads on the orbiter and six payloads on the rover. Through orbiting and roving, the mission will carry out all-round and multi-factor exploration of Mars, topography, surface material composition, subsurface substructural structures, surface physical field, and Mars space environment, expecting to contribute Chinese friends to human understanding of Mars by interpreting the acquired scientific exploration data. Exploring the vast universe will be an endless journey for a human being. We have drawn up a roadmap for the development of planetary exploration. In the future, we will carry out the Tim 1, 2, 3, and 4 mission and conduct asteroid sampling, Mars sampling, and Jupiter system exploration. Thus, making China's contribution to revealing the mysteries of the universe and making progress of human civilization. Exploring the universe is the common cause of mankind. We are committed to innovation-driven development. Guided by the needs of scientific exploration and the development of engineering technology, follow the purpose of peaceful use of outer space and the promotion of human civilization and social progress, and based on the principle of openness, cooperation, and sharing, and within our capabilities. We are willing to carry out extensive cooperation exchanges with international colleagues, including selection of scientific targets, selection of payloads, joint development of subsystems and system levels, mutual support of measurement and control resources, and sharing the scientific data. I hope that scientists and engineers in the field of deep space exploration all around the world will join hands to advance this great cause so the human footstep into deep space will go faster and further. Thank you.